Go ahead, YouTube. It's your girl Chanel, and in this video, I'm just gonna be speaking on what happened with me and Janaya. As you can see, it's going um, you know, it's kind of been rowdy on Facebook and stuff on Snapchat, and I know you've been wondering. I know you guys have been wondering, so I'm just gonna. I'm just gonna talk about that. It's not gonna get ready with me, kind of, because I'm doing my hair. You know, I'm gonna be doing my hair. <laughs> so, me and Janaya started out as best friends three years ago, approximately three years ago. Freshman year of high school. I was very, you know, I was vulnerable. I was. We both were in, we were in the cheer, it was a um, cheer tryouts. We had both, you know, been struggling to get the dance right. And so they suggested that we find a partner or somebody to, to practice with before tryouts came. And so me and Janaya, we locked eyes and you know, we became partners. We were, um, we were partners in the, um, the dance. We were, we were doing the dance together. We were kicking it. You know, it was, it was fun. Shortly that, later that day, we, um, we walked home together. I've never seen, I had never seen, noticed Janai, I guess, because we ended, we take the same bus. I had never noticed Janaya before, but we took the same bus, so we walked the same way. And we would get caught, we would get iced coffee every day after school, like, every day. It, the cheer thing was like three or four days. And so every day we would go, and we would sit, and we would get um, coffee. And we would just learn so much about each other. We would just learn so much, like... And so, me and Janai had instantly clicked back then. We had instantly clicked, so we were, you know, we were tight. We were tight. We were fucking with each other like nobody was fucking with us. So, it's a couple people that Janai was, you know, cool with before me and her. And that was... Shardasia and that was Paris. You know, all of these people were in her advisory, had advisories. And back then, freshman year, I was still a, I was still a boy. So I was in a boy's advisory. I hadn't been switched to a girl's advisory yet. I was still a boy. And so she it was Shardasia, it was Paris. They were, you know, they were just all three of them were tight. And I didn't think nothing of it because me and Janai was just gorgeous. So I was gorgeous. I was cool with them. I was cool with them. You know, we were all just, we were kicking it. And then came uh, a gay boy named Solomon that I met. Solomon was Charda one of Shardasia's good friends. And... And... That was that. Doing their whole little thing. And it's not that he intimidated me, but it's like, I guess I instantly put my guard up around other gay boys. And I don't know why I used to do that, but I don't do it anymore. It seems that they put their guard up against me because when I walk in the room, yeah. When I walk in the room, it's so much... You know, I give off so much energy. It makes them gag. And so I guess they feel like, you know, that we're in competition with each other. When our reality, we need to be trying to come together. We need to be trying to come together because... Because they is trying to, they trying to kill us off one by one. I, I know this ain't China outside. I forgot where I last left off at, but 
And now I was talking about Sonny Man and all of them. Okay. Fast forward, fast forward. Me and Janai got into it. I forgot we got it. Well, we got into it, Oprah, but, you know, we got into it. And we, we stopped talking for, like, a couple of months. This was freshman year. We stopped talking. We didn't, it went so long. It was, like, in the, close to the end of the year. And we still weren't talking. So, over the summertime, we didn't talk, you know. Until I reached out. I was on Brianna's, my friend Brianna Page. I reached out and I texted Janaya. And I was, you know, I was telling her how I missed her stuff. And all of that. The, the only reason that we started back talking was because I reached out. Okay? If I hadn't, if I hadn't, um, have reached out. Me and Janaya would not be, would not have been talking. So we got back to talking, we were cool, and, you know, that by this time, I wasn't talking to Paris or Shardasia anymore, because me and Shardasia had gotten to it too, so we weren't, you know, we weren't tight, we weren't kicking it like we used to when I first met them, you know, and stuff like that. So, I, um, I'm like, okay, me and Shardasia just kept getting into a cast, kept. Because it's like she wanted me to be worried about her. She kept saying things and was, you know, was initiating that I was so worried about her when it wasn't really good. But it wasn't about her. And I'm like, you want so, like, you want it to be about you so bad. Like, but it's not, it's not about you. Like, honestly, it's, it wasn't about her. And that's the part that I didn't get. Because... You know, I'm the type of person, if I got something to say about you, I'm going to say it. Okay, this side is straight, and this side is curly. What do you guys think I should go with, curly or straight? No fairy tales, conclusions, y'all. Okay, so we make up on the way. So, okay, I'm glad I didn't hear it, so fix these contacts after we go. I don't know where I left off. Fair for all. I'm finna keep it simple. I'm finna keep it short. Janaya freaked. No, this is raw and this is uncensored. Janaya fucked Anthony Parchman and she fucked Jason Cross. Jason Cross is Brianna's ex boyfriend. Anthony Parchman was my crush. Freshman, sophomore, freshman and sophomore year. And she considered, she considered us to be her friends. She considered us as real friends. And she did that. When she did that. That's my whole thing. It's like, you know, you say you're somebody's friend. Yet yeah, when I'm just, I'm looking back. <clears throat> just think about all the shit that she did. Just all the shit that she did. It's just. <sighs> you know. I'm just glad that I, I'm done with her. That I saved myself. You know. I'm just so glad that I saved myself. But um, don't think that I'm I'm thugging for YouTube and thugging on video. Cause all of this, all this that I said on here, I told on face, I told it to a face, I told on Snapchat, and I told it to the Facebook Live. So I don't make it like I'm just thug, you know. And I, I asked her, if I asked her, I asked her what's the issue, and she saying. She said, he said that I'm the one with the problem, I'm the one with the issue, and I'm like, yeah, I have an issue, yes, it is an issue. You wasted three years of my life, and you still got some of my clothes. You still got my clothes that I want. And I got some of her stuff, but I want my clothes. Run me my clothes. Run me my charger. Run my pink charger. All this shit, you need to run me. Run me my stuff. What the fuck are you talking about? Run me my shit. And then she wanna, she wanna screen record my, um, cause I burnt the pictures yesterday. She wanna screen record the, um, the pictures. And I'm like, the only person you can be sending it to is Shardasia. And I'm like, 
all that's all they do. They dug it. They so good. They want to do this. They want to do all that. When nobody has said anything to me, so y'all not really about it. Like, ugh, pitiful, weak, and disgusting. They just so weak. I hate a weak bitch. Cause I really, I really consider Janaya to be one of my friends. But a few months ago, it did. It started, it started falling off. It wasn't how we used to be. But I, I you know, I still held on because me and Janaya had three years together. We was together for three years. We were best friends for three years. But I'm done. You know, I don't have, I don't have time. It's the beginning. Of 2018, and I don't have time. I just don't. I don't. <laughs> How did I go? <laughs> How did I get up early and still end up being late? And I'm finna be late. I think so. I gotta see what time is it. But that's it for this video. I just wanted to tell y'all why me and Janaya is done. You know, I just wanted to get closure. You get it? Closure. <laughs> this is just me getting closure on my life and, you know, things that's going on. But I'm gonna show y'all the final look once I'm done. Almost done. Just gotta do a little more hair. But I want y'all to come up with a name for me to call y'all. Like a lot of YouTubers got their names for their people that they call them. I don't have a name for y'all. We gotta think of a name. This is the final look. My 40 inch hair. I can say I look good. I look very good. Very civil, civilized. But be prepared for a video next week or whatever. Bye.